welcome back to my film and TV channel. You're all staying safe and well. We're going over to Netflix today for a recent release. It isn't universally liked, but I thought this was okay in a sort of daft uh, horror sort of way. A bit a bit clumsy, a bit silly in parts. But hey, just, just turn your brain off. You'll be fine with this one. Uh, and don't be confused by the title as well. I put, I put this into Internet Movie Database. About uh, seven or eight films came up and this one didn't. I had to search around for it in fairness. We'll have a look at something that's called Monster. It's a 15 certificate. Yeah, it runs for 86 minutes, ideal ideal length of time for a film for me, directed by Racco Prajanto, and currently on Netflix, as I say. There's a lot of titles called Monster. This is the 2024 Indonesian movie on Netflix called Monster, revolving around two, two poor school children named Alana and Rabin who get abducted by a man named Jack. Yeah, there's no Jill. Jack feels like the real monster in this story as it becomes clear he's done this before, but he's not alone. And for me, the real monster is his wife, Myrny. Yes, not Jill. Also involved in these abductions and the film. Uh, if you're worried about subtitles, don't, because there's no dialogue at all in this. So well, well done, well done uh, to make it a, a sort of world-friendly film, if you like. The actors, we've got Anantia Kirana playing Alana in the movie. We've got Rabin, who plays the abducted boy, played by Sultan Hamanangan. Jack, the abductor, the nasty abductor, is played by Alex Abad. And Murney, his monster wife, is played by Marsh Timothy. All played very well on the basis that uh, it was all a matter of movement and face movements. And hardly oh, a bit of grunting, a bit of groaning, a bit of shouting, a bit of screaming. Uh, but obviously no verbal, verbal diarrhoea to listen to. Yeah, I say it was a mixed audience response to this, and I've, I can understand why. It's, it's not the greatest, but despite the lack of speech, uh, I thought they cast it incredibly well, especially the, the young girl, Anantia Girana, playing Alana, who uh, makes all of this work for me as well. I mean, the young lad does okay, but uh, it's all about the young girl in this. I do love the murky, uh, sort of one-place location, the murky house. He does get out of there sometimes. And it is a film, as I said, you have to disengage all gears in your brain. Uh, but it has enough jeopardy and silliness to keep you watching right to the end. And as it says, 80 odd minutes, hey, who can, who can complain? And despite Murney being the wife of the so called monster, because, uh, I think she is the monster. I think she's even worse than a, a, a chap, a fella. Uh, she doesn't appear, but she doesn't appear until halfway through, so that's probably why. But they get half and half. The husband gets the first half of the film, and she gets the second half to uh, try and get rid of these uh, two pesky children. But both are a great foil for our, well, at the end of the day, the young female hero in this. Yeah, as I said, fine run time. Uh, simple plot, of course it is. Edgy, daft, funny. Uh, not one that will live long in the memory, but I, I enjoyed the watch. Uh, well worth the effort, guys. It is, you don't expect too much and you, you'll be reasonably happy. I'll be fresh on Rotten Tomatoes. I'll be positive. On Metacritic, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. And if we go over into that movie database, they don't like it. Nope, 262 scores and reviews. I'm recording this on the 19th of May 2024. Uh, 262 scores and reviews have been left. It's only getting a 4.6 out of 10. As I said, not universally liked, but certainly liked by me. So uh, let me know what you think, guys. As I say, it's just a, a throwaway, throwaway horror if you like and uh say silly but hey oh, some good some of the best horrors are aren't they in fairness please if you are new to the channel push that subscribe button push the bell notifications everything film and tea of course if you check through the site reviews information blogs and you'll see stuff on my football team manchester city as well so if that's any interest uh, give it have a look or spread the word if you can guys to other people who might like it that'd be wonderful i'm um, trying to do a few do, do a few things for, for next year of course any shout outs you want for an organization or an individual and you're willing to uh, help support the channel in any way whatsoever, sponsor the channel if you like. Uh, I'm always open to offers and you can contact me through the various social media things I'm on. I've got the same address at X and TikTok at Bird underscore Deneen. I'm on Facebook at Bird Deneen. And of course, you can message me through uh, YouTube as well, guys. So it'd be great to hear from you and we'll, we can have a chat about that. Thanks for your support anyway for watching this. Give us a like, guys. Uh, that would be very kind of you. Until we meet again, oh, that's one thing, don't I? Please stay safe, everyone. Bye for now.